No way. Well, there's... That's Brenton. Hey, Lulu. Look at that little face. Come on now. I love these. Love these plants right here, man. Love those. Oh my goodness, there's so many. Look at this pond, dude. It's almost overflowing. There's so many bags in there. What is going on, crows? Welcome back to another video. We actually have a sponsor and a little bit more on them later on in this video. But we have an adventurous day, a very adventurous day, as you can tell by the intro. It's a vlog day. Before starting today's video, we are actually gonna do a little unboxing from Jamaica. Well, it didn't fit, so I had to wait for an hour online to get it for you. Well, let's so. hope the hour wait was worth it. <laughs> I'm sure it is. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Is that not insane? You gotta put that in your own Now, through travel, obviously, the corners are all banged up. It's my face, skull, and axolotl. We got the zebra eel coming out. We got a goldfish, a flower horn coming out from the back. Beta fish. My face is, like, separated. <laughs> Super talented. Dominic Inc. Shout out to you. Thanks for this. This is, this is awesome. Let's start off with our beautiful sponsor that uh, allowed us to get all these fish in the first place. Today's video is sponsored by Live Aquaria. Live Aquaria is committed to offering sustainably raised aquatic life that is either aquacultured or responsibly harvested, which includes careful attention to both the animals and the habitat. Live Aquaria is your single destination for all aquatic things. So we are gonna hop on to liveaquaria.com, so liveaquaria.com. Then right beneath that, as you can see there, is Marine's Diver's Den. Let's go to categories. You can search through all these different categories. We're gonna click on fresh water. Fresh water. Look at all these different fish that you could buy. Now you can shop with confidence because exactly what you see is exactly what you get. Live Aquaria seeks out the best corals, fish, invertebrates from the most responsible suppliers, aquaculture facilities, breeders, and hatcheries from the United States, Europe, and Asia. Now we just picked out all our fish and I put them on my phone so I can get you a better shot. We got some of these rainbow fish right here. We got some of these little head standers. Never seen them before, but I thought I'd get something that I've never had. We got a couple of those. And a couple of the miscellaneous fish. I will, uh, I'll see you when the box shows up. Oh, one bag. We're not even gonna go through them yet. Let's just put them into where they're going. This is the largest shipment of fish I think I've ever received. Now, Live Aquaria will actually teach you step by step on how to properly acclimate your aquatic life. Holy floating bags everywhere. Look at this pond, dude. Yeah. Ah, look at that. That is a crazy looking fish. See you later, buddy. Same exact fish, a little bit bigger that time. Woo, that was awesome. Triple bag. Ah, see those colors? And all those are going to school. Now you want to get a big old box like that delivered to your door? Go to liveaquaria.com. Get 20% off the entire site using my code CAFERO. C-U-F-F-A-R-O. Again, that is code CAFERO. 20% off at checkout. Get yourself some aquatic life for your new aquarium. And uh, don't be shocked if I show up at your front doorstep in the box. Hey, Lulu. <laughs> Hi, Mama. What are you doing? Hi, everyone. And Suzanne, what's going on? We are here at the farm, all the pigs waiting for me to feed and everyone's screaming, Boots! How to love the farm, man. Look at Kevin. Kevin! Oh, dude! Kevin, you just pooped, dude! You want, you want some? Nope. All right. Look at all the ducks. Gary won't shut up. Gary, shut up. Yay! Brenton! Do not do that. Hey, bud. Hey, Paul. What are you doing here, man? Just feeding the animals. <laughs> oh! <laughs> hey, Boots, let me distract them so you can get in. There you go. Okay, thanks. Mama! What's up, Mama Goat? Boots. Oscar, be careful with those horns. Feeding the big pigs. What's going on, big pigs? How you doing? There you go. Half a scoop each. You guys have to be on a diet because you're a little too big. <laughs> oh my god, dude. Mango almost took my legs out. Mango, you're such a good pig, you know that? Oh yeah. Yep. Tell us, hogs. All right. Nice and muddy out, but at least it's drying up now. It's drying up. There's two. There's three. And four. Four nice scoops for you guys. Now eat up. That's for the rest of the day. Hey, what are you doing, huh? 
That's the pops of the baby pigs that we have. There's Willow. Hi, Willow. You're so cute. There you go. Well, there's... That's Brenton. Oh, and the dog's gonna get him. Ah! <laughs> go, come get him. Go, go, go. Get him. Get him. Go! So I have an idea for the 1,000 gallon pond in the fish room, that pond right there. Those two platinum fish down there, and I'm walking on the side of the pond. Black gar, this melanistic gar. Is what I want to put in there. Like my more like, you know, expensive, <laughs> higher end fish I want to put in there. Especially because it's like the fish room, I feel like you should put the cooler things in there. And those three fish are going to get bigger of course, but we have other projects coming even bigger than the 4,000 gallon pond that we're doing soon. Like so much stuff that I can, just can't say anything, but it's coming. That's why I always encourage you guys to subscribe. Hit the subscribe button, turn the bell on so you don't miss stuff like that that's gonna happen. But yeah, I feel like this gar and the two uh, platinums right there like look at that. I feel like that and our albino pleco would be cool I think would be awesome in the thousand gallon pond and I want your honest opinion So I kind of want to do that here shortly, but I don't want to do it without asking the Caferos So let me know what you think in the comments down below comment what you think we can even throw like a cool like uh, the Oscars in there as well I just don't want to overdo it too much, but let me know. So today is most definitely a vlog video. Y'all know I make a lot of videos. I post a lot on this channel. So every once in a while it's due for just like a hangout update video. We got a bunch of new fish in today's video. It's a vlog day. I love making the vlog days. And then a lot of you will love watching vlog day. Although like most of my videos are vlogs, I just call these vlog days because we're not basing the video off a title and thumbnail, which typically we do. Big pigs. You guys are just so cool. I can't wait. Oh, should I just spill the tea? We're, we are expanding majorly soon. That's all I'm going to say. Now, if you have any ideas from that saying, then you can just blow in the comments and communicate with other Caferos and try to guess, but let's just say we're expanding very soon. Woo! We are back home and Hector's out here building something. I don't know what he's building. Hector, what are you building? My house, man, my house! <laughs> you know what Hector pulled up in? A couple videos ago, we got him a trailer and he actually showed up and surprised me. He returned the favor with another surprise. I would show you it, but the surprise that I got was on the trailer, so roll the clip when I woke up the other morning and Hector pulled up. No. Way. There's no. <laughs> Yo. What's up, amigo? Dude, you snapped. You like it? I love it. My Big. parents are gonna freak out. Your mama already know. She does? She kept it from me. He said, Come outside, I got a surprise for you. I said, All right. He said, Just be filming when I show up. The PC mobile. I'm in. <laughs> that is so cool. I out the trailer uh, yesterday. That is awesome. So if you're not familiar, the other day we actually surprised Hector with this trailer. He always had problems keeping his tools dry and not getting stolen out of the back of the truck. So I went out and I bought him this trailer. Obviously not with the stickers on it, but I bought him this. We, we bought him this trailer and Hector was super surprised and now he ended up coming back and surprising me with some stickers on the side. What do you Hector, think? Hector, that's awesome, buddy. Isn't that so that's sick? So Hector, you're the man. Yay, yay. You are the best. <laughs> this, for, this for you, man. This is so dope. I say, I have to do something for him. He made two shelves on this side, in the front already. Yeah, if you made two more, but dude, you got everything in here. Yeah, I need more tools. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, now I have the trailer, so I can buy web whatever I need. Back to Hector working here. We are actually building, by we I mean them, not me. They are actually building an overhang here because something's going right here. I'm telling you, your boy's always working on projects. Always, something's going on. We got the roof right here. How did he do this so quick? I don't know, man. I feel like we just left and it's already concreted in the ground. Yep. Let's go check on baby pigs. Oh, look at all the babies. They're all inside the little thing. Hi. Hi. Hey, this one has got so much meat on him. She's a little chunky little girl. So, the pigs have gotten a lot more personality. They've grown into themselves a little bit more. They're running around like little hamsters. Look at that little face. Come on now, come on. Look at that little face. Hi, you have blue eyes. You are beautiful little babies. You know that? So cute, look at him, he's curious. You could really start to see the personality of the little piglets come out now. Look at them, man, they're so tiny. <laughs> but one, two, three, four, and five right there with mama. And she's loving it in here. It's nice and shady. Aww. Go in there. You're one of them. <laughs> Hi there. 
All right, lock them in, let's go. Now, since we've been bouncing around all day, today I really wanted to get the structures done in the 1,000 gallon. Some live plants in the back and some rock work. I do have a spot in Miami, which is like an hour and 45 minutes from me, which we're probably gonna do very shortly because I wanna get those fish, or some sort of fish at least, in here soon. It's been cycling for a while now. Y'all have been asking for it, so the 1,000 gallon pond inside the fish room is going to have fish very shortly, but I do wanna do structure prior. Earlier today, we actually went out and tried finding cool stuff for the 1,000 gallon pond, but unfortunately, uh, well, swirl the clips. We are at a store that I used to go to all the time, a couple years ago when I first started up the YouTube channel. I actually kept my koi fish in there for a while. It's all grown in now, it looks amazing. We're in the back, um, but yeah, I came to get, I don't know really, I'll be honest with you, I just knew they had some cool stuff, like plants here. Kinda wanna get some live plants for the, for the 1,000 gallon pond. I love these, love these plants right here, man. Love those. But we're gonna have to figure out a mechanism, whether it's like keeping them in baskets or something to keep them above the water because obviously I can't completely cover these in water. I wish I could get some of these, but unfortunately like, they definitely need the sunlight. We don't have that in there, so that's not gonna work. Not as much as I thought. Yeah, there's actually nothing. No, there really isn't. So, let's go. Let's go. <laughs> Found some cool stuff, but not what we were looking for. So yeah, this is gonna be getting done very soon. So we have the 1,000 gallon project, and, oh yeah. Now we're talking. Check that out. This project, which is done now, you will see much more of this being built and what's going under here in the next video. It makes the fish room look so much bigger, just like the little add-on right there. Wait till you see, Caferos. Just wait. So in today's video, we obviously had that sponsor and they provided us with the largest amount of fish that I think I've ever received over shipment, which is super, super cool. Here is them a couple days later. I mean, as you can see how beautiful that rainbow fish in the back is there. I'm trying to get the best focus I can. There's a whole school of them. We have a bunch of these little headstanders, or whatever the heck they're called. I think that's what they're called. An angel fish from the guest aquarium. And as you can see, a couple of goldfish from that uh, goldfish stocking video. There's one, two goldfish. Three, four, five, all five right there. There's a quarry catfish right there from the guest room tank. These live plants are all from the guest room tank as well. So yeah. Bunch of new fish. Look at that soft shell back there. Filtration is doing amazing and the water is just so, so clear. So clear. Hey buddy. Just look at how pretty that fish is down there. It's nice to have some color in here now. It really is. And even more color, all of our cichlids over here. Yep, I'm in my pajamas. Hey! The fish room is looking absolutely amazing. Could not be happier, man. I can't wait to get the fish for this. Thank you so much, Kefaro. Subscribe if you're new, smash the like button and I'll drop this video even quicker, so just, just smash the like button. Hey. Say bye. Bye-bye. <laughs> Peace! Hey, <laughs> whoa. Hey.